Hello and welcome to the Daily Devotional for Monday, January 23rd, 2023. Get that off. Uh, It's alright to be human. When your mind wanders while you are praying, don't be surprised or upset. Simply return your attention to God. Share a secret smile with God knowing that He understands. Rejoice in the Lord's love for you which has no limits or conditions. Whisper God's name in loving contentment assured that the Lord will never leave you or forsake you. Intersperse these peaceful interludes abundantly throughout your day. This practice will enable you to attain a quiet and gentle spirit which is pleasing to God. As you live in close contact with God, the light of His presence filters through you to bless others. Your weakness and awareness are the openings through which the light of the light through which the light of the knowledge of God's glory shines forth. God's strength and power show themselves most effectively in your weakness. Scripture, be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid or terrified because of them. For the Lord your God goes with you. He will never leave you nor forsake you. Deuteronomy 31 verse 6. Instead, it should be that of your inner self, the unfading beauty of a gentle and quiet spirit, which is of great worth in God's sight. 1 Peter chapter 3, verse 4 For God, for God who said, Let light shine out of darkness, made his light shine in our hearts to give us the light of the knowledge of the glory of God in the face of Christ. But we have this treasure in jars of clay to show that this almighty power is from God and not from us. 2 Corinthians chapter 4 Verses six and seven, but he said to me, "But he said to me, My grace is sufficient for you, for my power is made perfect in weakness. Therefore, I will boast all the more gladly of my weaknesses, so that the power of Christ may rest upon me." Two Corinthians chapter twelve, verse nine, prayer. Pitch your tent over and dwell upon me, Lord. Your grace is enough for me. Even when problems arise, I will rely on your power and your strength through Christ in me. In Jesus' name, amen. And I hope everyone is having and continues to have a happy, healthy, and blessed week. I hope everyone had a great weekend. God bless. Keep the faith. And we'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye for now, folks.